Hey guys, so I know that discipleship is going to be something that God's really growing in me in this next season. And everyone has the same question, well, how do you start discipling? And, you know, it's a good question. And then it's like, okay, well, maybe we do it like Jesus did. Now, Jesus went and he went up to these people, and you know, like, let's say, you know, the fishermen and says, follow me and I'll make you fishers of men. He invited them to come along. And, you know, like at the time, the, the culture is a little different, obviously, like all of these, you know, young men were being raised up, you know, to, you know, follow a rabbi to be brought into that training because it was a, that was an honor, you know, but, you know, at the same time, man, how many people would join just if we asked? If we say, hey, look, you know, I am, I'm hungry. Like I, I not, not physically hungry. I'm spiritually hungry. I want, I want to grow. And I think the best way to grow is this, is if I'm in a group together with a bunch of people, with a few people, a few guys that I can really, you know, like share my heart with or ladies, a few ladies that I can just share my heart with and kind of challenge each other. And we can just push each other to grow. I bet you that there are people around you that would be like, yes, I've been looking for that. I want that. That's, that's, you, you've taken the words out of my heart, out of my heart, out of my mouth. And I just didn't know how to say it. So I, I think that sometimes we can get ourselves all kind of, you know, maybe gassed up of, you know, how do I do this? How would I start? I don't even know how I would start. Well, find some people that are hungry to grow spiritually and that are willing to commit. And then you say, Hey, can we do this together? And I think that you'll find that, you know, like that's a lot easier than what it, what it seems. So, and you know, we'll talk a little bit more, I guess, as we go through this month, I'll just kind of mention some of the ways, um, real quick though. What, what do you do once you are discipling them? Well, you live life together, you know, you share your life with them. Yeah. I mean, there's, there's obviously gotta be, you know, like scripture, maybe you push yourselves to, to serve, to share the word, to evangelize, to do all this. But, and, or maybe you read a book together, you know, and you share and you talk about it. But as long as whatever you do opens the gateway for you guys to have life together, that is the point of discipleship. That's what Jesus did. He went around to all these towns and was doing all these things so that the disciples could see the life that he was living and they could live life together. They could walk hand in hand. He could share the secrets of the kingdom with them. So that being said... Sometimes it's just easy. Just ask. Thanks for taking a minute.